What's going on, people? Fame Entertainment here from the official WeGameHere.com. If you missed my last video, please go back and check it out. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, go in the comment section down below. Positive and negative feedback is always welcome, so please let your voice be heard. Now, Gears of War fans, I know you guys are absolutely excited. I know Gears heads... Ge Gears of War fans, gearheads are some of the biggest fans out there. I mean, people getting tattoos left and right. You guys are excited. You guys love Gears of War. You have a great passion for it. And we all know Gears of War 4 is being worked on. Um, we're hoping to get something, uh, some type of teaser at E3 that would be great to hear. Some type of um, news about it, some type of teaser, something. You know, at E3 to get is ready for Gears 4. Now, this recently uh, has come out that there will be a, as a report from Polygon, that there will be a Gears of One remaster. And that got me thinking, why just the first one? I believe um, Halo Massive Collection kind of set the standard for remaster games. You know, four games, 60 bucks. And I thought the same thing could have happened here with, the, um, with uh, Gears of War. I know... The whole Marcus Phoenix collection was something that was fan made, and Rod Ferguson had come out and said there will be no Marcus Phoenix collection but a Gears project. And then so now we hear that it is the first Gears remastered. Like I say, I believe Halo Master's collection, as far as what it was supposed to be, I know it had its issues. But for what it was supposed to be, to me, it set the standard for a remastered game, not just a single game for, you know, 50 bucks, 60 bucks, whatever it is. Now, if it's first Gears, if they make it 30 bucks, to me, I'm okay with that. I'm, I'm not okay with it being 50 or 60 bucks. 40 bucks maybe, but 50 and 60, I, I, I just, I just, I just wouldn't be okay with that. You know, one game just for it to be, you know, you know, remastered, retouched a little bit. You know, unless it's a complete overhaul, then okay, maybe 50 bucks. But to me, they, they should have kept along the lines of the Master Chief Collection and, and gave us all three games. I know people are still going to buy. People are still excited. Um, I'm hoping, and this is just me, I'm hoping that the that uh, the Gears of War the remaster will be some type of beta for Gears of War 4 or whatever. I know it couldn't be Gears of War 4 and it, whatever it's called the next iteration of Gears. My hope is that if you do make this game, you know, 50 bucks, which it can't be 60, you know, to be remastered. To me, I think 50 bucks is the max it can go with it only be in one game if you put some type of beta access for the next iteration of gears that would be absolutely amazing i could see that at e3 them coming out and showing off the gears first gears and just say hey you know for the, you guys who bought this game we're giving you access to and then boom here's what a, the next iteration of gears a teaser i think that would be great i don't know what you guys think in the comment section down below if you guys heard something i haven't heard what do you guys think do you guys think that this gears with them only just making one could that possibly tie in the next iteration of gears with this game let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below once again i am fame entertainment from the official we game and i'm out Fuck with you lame, my side bitch your main, blame it on fame. This is no fame.